Our brains operate in two distinct modes, System 1, which is fast, automatic, and unconscious, and System 2, which is deliberate and conscious but requires significant effort. Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video. In this video, I will show you how to create these motion graphics in CapCut PC. All the assets that are used in this video are available on my WhatsApp channel. You can find the link in the description below. So let's get started by creating our background, add a default text layer and decrease its length. Now double click, then press Windows plus dot key at the same time. This will open the emojis and symbol section. From here select the squares and increase its font size so that it fits the screen. Now I will change its color to something like this. After doing this right click here and create it a compound clip and drag it down. Next I will import our brain PNG right here, increase its length, now go to remove VGs, click auto removal, this will remove its background then scale it down, go to adjust HSL and then increase the brightness, decrease the saturation, this will give us this look. Now we need to cut the brain into two parts, to do that right click, to do that go to basic mask add mask choose a split mask and rotate it 90 degrees place it where you want the brain to be cut it into two parts now right click copy and paste this now inst instead of creating another background just click the invert button this will cut it this into two parts you cannot see right here now now we need to animate this slap basic go to check uh, add transform keyframe move this keyframe last this will be our end of animation then drag this down like this do the same with the other add transform keyframe move the keyframe forward and drag it down like this now to make it smooth right click show all keyframes and cubic out do the same with the other like this now I want the right part to come after a few seconds so I will just drag this layer a little bit forward like this now we need to create another background add a default text where the animation ends press windows and press windows and dot key and again select a scare change its color to something greenish dark green like this and increase its font size so that it fits the screen right like this now hide one layer like this one and place it where the brain is cut it into two parts so that it fits then unhide the other now where the animation ends right click and create a compound clip drag it down like this moves behind then go to video add a transform keyframe move this move this keyframe forward and bring the background down like this this will create animation like this now i will right click show all presets and cubic out this will make this smooth now we need to add our text i have already written the all the text so that i can save time i will just copy and paste so add a default text where the animation of this ends right here so our first text is system one so i will just test system one and change its font i will go with the, this one and i will in the case section title case and i will decrease its a decrease its font size for the color i will choose this dropper and choose the greenish color this will be opposites it may it will look good now when our first text is done i will just copy and just paste move this to the other side and our second test is text is system 2 so i will just copy it and paste it here and for this go to color select dropper tool and choose the opposite color like this now this is done now we need to add some arrows so i will i choose this 
so i have this green screen just import it right here go to bg remove and select chroma key and like this you can remove its background like this now i will go to basic and just decrease its size and rotate it rotate it like it ends on this right here this will give us this animation it's looking good i will just copy it and select paste and i will drag it here and i will go to this and choose a rotate option this will look like something like this you can adjust the rotation to make it look more good like this now you can see our animation is looking something like this you can add animation to system 1 and 2 like a uh, uh, type 2 1 you can increase the duration to make it small, uh, slower like this now we need to add our other text so add our default text right here our first text is fat uh, fast I misspell it so I will just copy it and paste it right here choose the font like uh, this font and again color to other opposite color and drag it right here I will add another node add a default text layer press windows and dot key windows and dot this will open this and I will select a arrow like this and I will choose its color to be like this the opposite color and I will just drag it down and paste it right here next to our text you can drag it down so it does not intersect with the now I will just copy this and click paste I will drag this up this is our second so I will just copy the other text automatic and like this just paste it right here you can like decrease the font size so that it fits our frame make the first letter big like this again I will copy this and just simply paste it above and drag it up drag it down our third text is unconscious so I will just copy it and just double click plus ctrl v and paste it like this so our first text is done I will just copy it for further copy and paste so I will drag this down drag this forward for some time now just right click on the text layers individually and create them into a compound clip like this I will increase this font size to I will increase just drag this forward so that it appears after the this animation is ended now I want I want one text at a time uh, with uh, respect to our voiceover so I will just click here and unhide so this is our first then I will drag this forward and they will appear right after on another like this now I will just click here and add animations and add you can use these or like these these are too fast you can just add unfold and again animation unfold and then again animation unfold you can uh, you can choose the animation according to the voiceover now we'll just increase this one like this and and then it's free for and then increase this and you will see the background is extended so once the animation is ended i will choose these ones right here and i will drag them here now i will click this make it a compound clip and just mirror it so that it so that it's like 
to the other side go to video and just double click here and choose the yellow color and this this color like this and place it like this now i will type our text slow like this and just double click con plus control plus e like this and change its color to the opposite one like this again I will just copy these two and click paste bring them upwards and just drag them down the next is effortful and again I will copy this and again I will just control double click and plus control V and effortless effortful like this and like that again double click and copy and just flip paste drag them upwards so that it's organized drag it down like this now our last our text is conscious like this and I will just double click and press ctrl plus v and paste it like this now I will create compound clips for each layer like this and like that again bring this forward so that it appears after one another like that and just animation unfold again unfold and again unfold like this so at the end our animation is looking like this so that's it if you found this video helpful make sure to like and subscribe to my channel for more videos and future and i will see you in the next one until then take care bye